Daniel J. Howard here, and I have, what's your name? Linda. Linda. This is like her third time playing pickleball. She's got phenomenal tennis skills, but she's not ever had a pickleball lesson. That so we're going to do a lesson today, and we're going to teach you some of the fundamentals of pickleball, and let's see how she develops. Sounds great. I'm excited. All right, Thank let's you. go. Let's do it. <laughs> Linda's brother is also here with us. He's a phenomenal tennis player, also picked up pickleball recently, has some experience more than Linda. I'm going to teach you guys a game. This is foundational to pickleball. Okay. We're going to do some dinking. Okay. Uh, obviously, you guys have great skills with the ground strokes and ripping through the ball, but one of the foundational things you want to learn with pickleball is how to dink well. Here's how this game slash drill works. Jimmy, you are trying to get the ball to touch inside this non-volley zone on our side 10 times in order to score one point. Ooh. We can deny him from trying to get the ball in this non-volley zone. Okay. Or you have to win two by either defeating us with a winning shot or if we make an error. Okay. That's an automatic point. So you can score a point by either causing an error, hitting a winner twice, or you're trying to get the ball in the non-volley zone 10 times. If you accomplish that, you score one point and you move over to the other half. Now, if you lose one, you hit in the net, you hit it wide, or we hit a winner on you, your turn is over and we rotate and it will be one of our turn next. Okay. Okay. Ready? All right. All right Score zero, it. zero. I'll feed it in and here we go. That's one. Oh, okay. That's, that, so that's an, got an error. Got it. You okay. essentially scored half of a point. You stay there. We're allowed two mistakes or two winning shots on your part. Okay. Let's go again. You have one touch and we have one error. That's two. Three. Four. You scored it. That counts. Okay. Now you you hit one winner. We had one mistake. You score the point. You now flip over to the other half. And you try to continue all the way up to seven. No one's ever gotten all the way to seven in one turn. So maybe <laughs> you're the first. <laughs> Good shot. Okay, so if we pop one up, you have permission to go after it. Now that's half of a point, so you stay. Remember, you gotta get to two winners or errors in order to score that point. You don't have any touches in the non-volley zone yet. That's one. Two. Three. Four. Five. If you lose count, we'll just make something up. Let's go with seven. Eight. <laughs> Nine. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Now, either way, if we had let that bounce, that would be 10. You would score the point. But because we made a mistake, that's two mistakes. You score the point Still anyway. score the point. Okay. I might have miscounted somewhere in there anyhow. You gotta make mistakes with scoring just like you make mistakes with hitting a ball. That's okay. We'll just move on and try to correct it next time. Okay. You have two points. Obviously, we each have zero. We gotta work our way over there. Okay. We gotta deny him. Here we go. One. Two. That's a good ball. Yeah, Jimmy scored half a point for that. Good shot. That's a point. All right, here we go, Linda. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Woo! He's out. Jimmy has to forfeit his turn. Okay. How many points did you get to, Jimmy? You got to three? Okay, three and a half. You, next time you get back over here, if you get back over here, you'll go back to three. And you'll resume from there. Gotcha. Now it's my turn to try and score. Let's see how I do. You may kill it. You may do whatever you want. He can kill too. I can, I can take advantage of any opportunity I want to. 
So the goal becomes keep that ball down. Yeah. If you pop one up in a real match, you're penalized for that. Yeah. You don't want to experience those pop-ups. Yeah. You got to keep it down. That's why you're rewarded for hitting 10 balls down low into that non-volley zone. Yeah. If you pop one up, you're going to pay a price. That's why we allow those speed-ups to occur because if, if it was just a dinking game, it's okay, but you don't learn yeah. when you're going to be you know, taken advantage yeah. of by hitting a high ball. Yeah. And you also learn a little bit of when you might want to push the envelope a little bit, speed it up, and take some chances. Yeah. All right, ready? Here we go. That's good. One. My shot was a little deep, so it didn't count. That's two now. That's three. Four. Five. Good dink. That's it, Linda. Six. Ooh. I score half a point for that. I have six touches and half of a point. Seven touches. Try it denying me from hitting that non volley zone now. I'm back to zero touches. I have one point. Good denial. One. Two. Three. Good dink, Linda. Four. Five. Good try. I, I think it's a good opportunity, though. You get that it's high ball, you higher. recognize it. Go ahead, and you have this full area on my half court to hit mm -hmm. into. I have five touches, and that gives me half of a point. Six. Good denial. Well, Seven think... touches. Eight. It's nine. Uh, uh, oh, You're smart to try extra, though, because if you hit me a softball, I'm probably going to drop one in for number yeah. 10. So it's okay to push a little bit at that point. I have two points. One. Nice. Two. Well nice. done. I'm out. Okay. If you hit a winner on me or I make a mistake, my turn, my turn is over. So good job. If you have an opportunity, take it. That way you're being a little aggressive. At the same time, you're denying the opponents from being really aggressive against you. Okay. All right, Linda's very first turn, turn at this game. <laughs> See how it goes. Linda's just not super comfortable dinking yet. No. Got all the other skills from the backcourt and yeah. great hands and the ability to control the ball, but this is what's going to elevate your game in pickleball. Yeah. Ready? That's one. Nice touch. That's two. Three. Good job. Oh, that's too bad. It's good looking. Oh. Good looking opportunity there. Gotcha, gotcha. I gotta stay consistent. Jimmy, you have three points, right? You'll be on the left side. We'll play the right side is even. Left side is odd. Gotcha. So anytime you have an even score, it's right. Since you ended up with three last time, you'll be on the left. That's one. Two. Ah! Well, Linda took a chance. Jimmy made her pay. That's good hands. That is half of a point. We made one mistake. Oh! Don't give it to the body. Ah. Jimmy with a little net love right there. Good shot. Jimmy's now got four points. Oh! One touch. Two touches. Three touches. I was That's thin. long. So even though Jimmy had half of a point right there, you gotta that goes away. You remain at four points. Okay. But when you come back over here, you'll remain at four. You don't get credit for that half. Good, Linda. That's one for me. Oh, wrong court. Two for me. Three. Use those legs, huh? Good get on that lob, which is legal, by the way. I can do whatever it takes to try to score a point. I believe that's six touches. Nice. You got me. Well done. If oh. I hang it up and you lean in, it's a smart play. 
Got it. You're not limited to just thinking softly, in other okay. words. Yeah. If the opportunity is there, go for it. Okay. You can push, you can be as aggressive as you want, just know that there's risk associated yeah. with that. Like yeah. when you attack Jimmy, he's right here. Probably expect he's gonna be ready and he's gonna knock you yeah. back. So you gotta pick and choose wisely when you're gonna speed it up. Oftentimes you will dink it. Try to keep it down and deny us from hurting you. Got it. Yes, pick and choose your spots. That's exactly right, Jimmy. You're at four, I'm at two. Linda's at zero thus far. One touch. That's two. That's three. That's still three. Good denial, Jimmy. Four. It's five. Good job. Oh, ah. Linda. Really got to do. Got to do that. You feel how this forces you to really lock in and focus on yeah. dinking the ball, moving it around, yeah, and controlling this ball with some touch. Yeah. Processing is. It's, well, it's, hard it's, with it's this. a little bit foreign. Yeah. Yeah. You know, coming from tennis background. Yeah. This is a little unfamiliar, but yeah. you're getting it. Okay. Yeah, that's two. Three. Nice. Good shot. You got three touches, correct? Plus half of a point for hitting a winner. Ah! Wow, the consistency part is really, it's really hard. <laughs> that's the goal, it's yeah. consistency. Yeah. But also in a way that's not just, it's too soft. It's be quality consistency. 100%, quality dinks. Yeah. High quality dinking here. One. One and a half, that's right. Good denial. Nice. That's two, three, four. Oh, Linda. Use those Get legs. It in. Get it in. Uh, that's two. Well done. A way to keep it simple. Uh, Good, Jimmy. Run, rip that if you feel like it. It was there. Eight. Nine. Come on, Jimmy! Point. Ah! La, la, la. I think Jimmy's getting tired. Ah! <laughs> Zero touches, one mistake. Come on, up. One. Good denial. Two. There you go. Use those legs for strength and balance. This. Totally legal. You may go around the post, 100%. If either side hits the ball wide enough, you may go around the post either half of the court. Got it. Even though that's the open half where you're technically not allowed to go, if I give you that wide ball, Thank I you. should be penalized. So you are well within your rights to go around the post. Good shot. All right, one point right here. Let's go, Linda. Oh, that's yes, a half a point. Mistake right off the bat. Zero touches and one mistake. One touch. Oh, good dink. Oh. There's a score. Oh. You got one point. That's an excellent dink, by the way. If you can find my non-dominant foot, that's a good play. Forces me to either lean back oh. or get crowded here. And you get it's off balance. Easy. It could potentially push me off balance. Okay. Yeah. Gotcha. So if you hit that target, at least forces me to make a decision. Am I going to open up my stance and play it from here? Not easy. Or am I going to try and take it early from my foot? Got it. Also not easy. Yeah. Okay. One. That's deep, so it doesn't count for a touch. Two, three. That was good. Three touches, one winner. That was good, four touches. Good denial, Linda, good denial, Linda. Well done. 
Ah, uh, took a risk. Too risky. Too well, it forces risky. you to make that decision. Do you have the ability to lean in and take that ball, or is it better to let it bounce? Yeah. Either way, he hit a good ball. If he can keep it low and put some sting on it, Reset. then it puts us in a tough spot. Because okay. we either have to lean in, hopefully maintain balance and control it, yeah. or it's on the ground and we can't really do much with it. Yeah. We at least can't okay. play offense off of that ball. Yeah. One. Could have denied that. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Good, Linda. Nine. Ten. Ten. There you go. Scored gotcha. the point. That's the first time anyone has scored a point by getting 10 touches. It's fun. Oh, let's do it. Did you get 10? That's right. Keep the grind. You're just grinding me down over and over. I couldn't lean in and get it. I couldn't do enough to you to make you pop one up. That's well done. There's the consistency piece. Didn't allow me to really hurt you. Yeah. You're at six now, right? Yeah, six. six, four, one. Yeah. Here we go. One. Let's get him. Linda. You can't. There we go. All I had to do was say the word. <laughs> I'm it. I'm at four. It's once. Good touch. Two. Oh. Way long. Oh. Risky. Right here. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. That was in. Six, seven, good touch. Eight, come on, get there, Linda. Nine. Uh, no, no point scored yet, though. Yeah. Nine touches plus one mistake. Yeah. You make one mistake or you get one touch. Yeah. You win this point. Touch, good. You win the rally, go ahead and slide over to the other side. You got two points. Let's go, Linda. Keep those legs under you. Stay confident, think in this ball. Right. Get low. A lot of it has to do with the legs. You can keep a strong lower body. What it means is you can stay balanced and you can maintain stability controlling this ball. Yeah. So key. That's two. Four, five, six, good spot. Off balance. Six touches, one mistake. Oh, that's too good. Seven points, right? Nice. Jimmy wins this round. Nice watch there. Well good. done. How did the dance feel? Feels good. I feel like I definitely learned some new skills. I didn't know some of the things, like the big gig and the watching out for the ball, okay. the variety. Yeah. It's hard. <laughs> feel like this is a game you might practice more often? Probably if I have people to hit with. Yeah, if you get yeah. two other players to hit yeah. with. Yeah. yeah. It, it's foundational. Keep that in mind that the dinking quality just has to increase. Yeah. yeah. If you can get the dinking ability on par with your ground yeah. strokes and the volleys, yeah. then your game is just going to elevate to a whole new level. Nice. So, thank you. you did really well. Thank you. Good First job. lesson today. Let's go. <laughs>